beautiful vegetation barrier which keeps particulate matter, carbon dioxide and your good air, purified air goes out for the readily available for the people. It also helps in water recharge and the best part I find for urban center that it become hub for imparting nature education. You are making and creating a, an informed citizen who can ask raise questions and try to understand that what is right for bringing quality of life in a city. A flock of migratory greater cormorants have taken over the most prized spot to sunbathe. The lake is part of the 457-acre Yamuna Biodiversity Park on the floodplains of the river Yamuna in the northeastern part of Delhi. Two decades ago, this was just a barren piece of land and the salinity of the soil so high that developing a self-sustaining ecosystem here looked like a distant dream. Eighteen years later, it has successfully become a benchmark for environment conservation and restoration of historical wetlands in the country. 2016, we get animal of highest trophic structure, that is leopard. And leopard came and stayed for more than 20 days, killed two Nilgai calf, was ready to stay. Suggested that the ecosystem created by us is very, very functional. And now we have seven biodiversity park in Delhi itself, spread over an area of about 3,000 acres. Urban expansion has put metropolises like New Delhi under immense pressure. For the nearly 30 million residents in the national capital region facing excessive pollution and rapidly deteriorating groundwater levels, urban jungles like Yamuna Biodiversity Park stand at the forefront of the fight to achieve ecological balance. In the development matrix, environment is losing very, very fast. Uh, rivers and forests are not being respected in urban landscape. The urban landscape might be having you know, very high per capita income, but the quality of life is very, very poor. From the beginning, Pritesh Mishra has been part of the core team called the Multitaskers, who are the backbone of this endeavour. They have worked tirelessly to make this a functional habitat for more than 2,000 species of plants and animals. This mosaic of wetland and forest provides conservational, educational and recreational benefits. This is not beautiful, but it is a source of source of source of the human life for a good way to grow up. Yes, it is one thing that we have done in our life that we have done good and that we have done good and that we have done good and that we have done good. For Dr. Khutsar and his team, this narrow shallow wetland imitating the river Yamuna, recognizes the full array of interactions within an ecosystem, including humans, in a bid to sustain and enforce habitat and species protection in the long run, more than 250,000 students from state-run schools visited the park as a public education initiative each year before the pandemic. A lot of labor is required to achieve this target. It's a slow process because ecology itself acts very slowly. But the moment you reach to a level when it starts functioning, you get a lot of things out of it. 